I'm Robert Lissatz and today I'm going to show you a quarantine workout. It's more martial arts oriented because this channel is all about being safe, fit and prepared. And these are the qualities if you want to be a modern day samurai. In this video I will also explain the core principles that will definitely help you to get and stay fit in times of quarantine and even when the whole crisis will be over. Lately I hear from colleagues complaints like I can't train because my dojo or gym is closed. Really? Listen, if you really want to work out and train martial arts, combat sports, self-defense during the quarantine, you will find a solution for sure. Where there is a will, there is a way too. Two square meters of floor is all you need to train your techniques and to do some cardio and mobility work. Now, I will explain my training philosophy so you can copy it and adapt it to your needs. So, how do I stay fit in general and also in these quarantine times? I always find time and a way to work out. I don't care if I live a normal life or if there are tough times like now. Why? Because I changed my definition how long a training session should last years ago, when I had to work night shifts, be a family man and also a business owner. Normally, when we think of a training session, we have in mind that it should last at least one and a half hour or two. In normal times, this works if you have a 9 to 5 job, no kids and no other hobbies. At that time I had to accept that a training session can last only 1, 2, 5 or 10 minutes because during the day it's hard to take 2 hours off just to work out, at least for me. But you can always squeeze a 5 or 10 minute training session between one and another task. The same approach is working very well in quarantine times, even if you have to cook, clean your apartment, work from home and taking care after your children. If this works for me, regardless if there are normal times or times of crisis like this one, it should work for you as well. You will say, okay, a five minute workout a day is not enough. And of course, you're right. That is why I will squeeze as many micro training sessions into my quarantine day as possible. Here 10 minutes, there 5 minutes and so on and it sums up. On a bad day I can work out like this maybe only in total for half an hour but on good days all the micro trainings together can last sometimes even more than 2 or 3 hours. That's a lot. The other definition that I had to change many years ago was what a normal training should look like. I was taught at the faculty of sport that the normal training should start with warm up exercises followed by the main part and end with some cool down activities. I had to let go of those rules too. Because you do what you can in these 5 or 10 minutes which you have available. If you're making some shadow boxing for 10 minutes, perfect. If you're doing some push-ups, you start with easy variations and then you do some difficult ones. You can make the exercises shown in the video one after another or you can make two or three in one micro training session and three or four in another micro training session. The exercises shown in the video should just serve as an inspiration. You really have the best possible conditions to come out of this crisis way better than you were before the crisis. There are also many people who have way more time in the quarantine than when their life was normal. If you're one of them, use it wisely, work out, be creative, have fun. And now a bonus trick to implement even more movement into your daily quarantine life. Try to implement as much movement in your daily life in quarantine as possible and combine these movements with ordinary everyday tasks. Here are some examples. You can drink a morning coffee in a deep squat, you can do some burpees while you're cooking lunch, you can stretch while you're reading a book or listening to a podcast and the list goes on and on. If you're new here, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification. As I said at the beginning, on this channel we explore what it takes to be safe, fit and prepared like a modern samurai. Join us and check out the videos on the end screen if you like to. See you in the next video. Bye.